all the marbles, the UFC middleweight championship of the world. Between the last style bender, Israel Adesanya, and Robert Whittaker. middleweight champion of the world. Here he is, the number one middleweight contender. For a long time, this man has been one of the best 85ers in the world, but this title fight eluded him. It is here right now. He is healthy. He is smack dab in the middle of his prime, and he believes he is the best 85er in the world and is out to prove just that tonight and walk away with 12 pounds of UFC gold. So here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world. This man ubiquitously regarded as the top 85er at present. Some people believe this is the greatest middleweight of all time. He certainly does, and he has goals even beyond that. He wants to be one of the greatest mixed martial arts athletes of all time. And in order to preserve that goal, this is a title defense, simply put, that he's got to have. Kill the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Adesanya is two years the elder. He will have a seven inch reach advantage. All right, now for the particulars inside the octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC middleweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 24 wins, five losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting from Sydney, New South Wales, Australia, presenting the challenger, Robert Whitaker. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 21 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world, Israel the Lamb. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. So here we go with round one between Robert Whitaker and the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Australia and New Zealand at times are aligned. Certainly not in this matchup tonight. Not tonight. Not tonight because both of these guys 
both want to win this fight. They're two of the most talented martial artists in the world, and both feel as though they have the perfect style to beat the other. Wild attempt with the right hand there. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, big left hook there. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Doing a nice job putting it all together. Straight right. Oh! So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Oh, what a job to get the head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got hurt bad. Ooh, what a punch. That one appeared to stun him. Who's hurt? Serve him up. Oh, he might be out. He's hurt. Oh, straight right. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to... Whoa! Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Go finish this fight. Nice defense there. Huge block. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Got clip with the right hand. Oh, just out of range with that punch attack. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Oh, my goodness. What a fight. You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent. But that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush. And the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. Oh, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight. But don't ignore all the work he did with his hands. And give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like he got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is going to stop for this contest at 4 minutes, 27 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by...